Spider-Man No Way Home is building enough momentum just off leaks and rumors and the worst kept secrets on the internet to possibly be the biggest Marvel movie yet, even uh, in the midst of a pandemic. We'll have to wait and see, but there is so much hype on this movie. We've only had one official trailer, but the theories and speculation and leaks and rumors have been going at it for years. Let's be real. I mean, we're talking two years back and it really feels like a different animal when it comes to this movie and movies in the past and leaks and rumors that come out and theories and plot speculations and things like that. And today, well, we continue down that path. Welcome everybody to the Chaos Multiverse. My name is Jimmy or Chaos and today we are going to talk about yet another leaked fight scene that is happening, well, allegedly happening in Spider-Man No Way Home. And as always, let me give the official spoiler alert right now. If this is going to ruin your experience in any way, click off the video. You're not going to hurt my feelings. I totally, totally get it. But if you like going down this rabbit hole, here we go. Now, we're not talking about a fight scene that has to do with the Sinister Six. We're not talking about any type of scene that has to do with Tobey Maguire, Andrew Garfield, uh, or Tom Holland. We're actually going to be talking about a fight between two official... Avengers. And a lot of you probably saw this in the trailer and you put two and two together. We've had leaks and rumors in the past that have said this is actually going to happen and the reasoning uh, behind why it's going to happen. And today we're going to break it down because there is a new article out specifically talking about a fight between Doctor Strange and Tom Holland's Spider-Man. And this comes from thecosmiccircus.com. And guys, before we get into it, I wanted to let you know we are giving away a PS5 bundle at 10,000 subscribers. All you have to do is uh, be subscribed to the channel. Like any video you want, leave a comment who your favorite Marvel character is and your Twitter handle. That way, if you win, uh, I can actually get hold of you and give you your prize. We are cruising past 6,000. Thank you for all the love on the Venom Let There Be Carnage content and the no spoiler review. It was, it was pretty amazing to fly out to LA and get to see that premiere. So thank you for all the support on the channel, guys. I'm truly excited uh, about the direction we're heading. But now, we have to focus on Spider-Man No Way Home, at least for this video today. So, written by thecosmiccircus.com, and I say take with a grain of salt, this is all a legend, it's not confirmed. You guys know, uh, you know the merry-go-round, you know how it works. And we got our first official teaser trailer, and uh, the rumors are we will get the actual big trailer, the one that's going to be longer and show us more, towards the beginning of November. So we'll talk about that in the future too. But we took something from... Uh, the trailer we got. We saw the train scene with Doctor Strange and uh, Tom Holland's Peter Parker. And everybody put two and two together pretty rapidly uh, that they were actually kind of going at it. They were uh, they were testing each other. They were in uh, what you could call a fight. Now, when I say a fight scene, I don't mean Scarlet Witch versus Thanos, okay? I mean more of a uh, Captain America Civil War where you know they're all going to fight, but they're not really going to hurt each other, if you know what I mean. That's the kind of fight scene uh, that this looks like it's going to be. So let me catch you guys up real quick on all the, the, the leaks and the plots that are out there that kind of go uh, with this. So the plot goes as followed. Peter does not like the fact that he is now known as Spider-Man Mysterio. Uh, outed him to everybody. So he goes to Doctor Strange, and this is a very summarized version of it, and he wants him to cast a spell to make everybody forget. Well, guess what? Doctor Strange, he's down for the task, and allegedly they cast the spell. You saw him in the bottom of the sanctum in the trailer. Things go wrong, and this could be a point where the timelines actually start to merge together. Now, we know at the end of the Loki series that Sylvie kicked it all off when uh, she put the sword uh, or the dagger through He Who Remains. But Doctor Strange's spell could be what actually uh, is the, uh, the first wave, if you will, the first connection of timelines, because we know the Sinister Six are coming, at least some of them are coming. We know Doc Ock and Green Goblin are coming, Electro, and they're all coming from other timelines. The Sam Raimi timeline, the Amazing Spider-Man timeline, and we're pretty sure this is the catalyst that kicks all that off. So, with that being said, uh, this uh, plot leak says that there's an altercation between the two inside the Sanctum, and Peter is going to swipe an artifact from Steven's 
collection. Now, uh, if you look at the trailer and the shot where Doctor Strange is uh, knocking Peter's astral projection or whatever out of his body, he is holding this box. We've talked about this box in the past, this mysterious box that could be the, the way to fix everything, or it could actually be Peter tries to steal it before they do the spell. I don't know. Marvel's really good with misdirect. But according to this plot leak, Peter is going to steal this box out of his collection uh, in the Sanctum. And then what follows is a chase scene. And you guys saw it in the trailer. Doctor Strange is doing his crazy uh, stuff with the trains, all of his Inception type stuff. And Peter appears to be running. Now, according to this leak, Peter is going to actually almost get away because he's fast, he has agility, he has a spider sense to kind of avoid things that Doctor Strange is throwing at him. But the ending is supposedly going to be where Strange uses his Cloak of Levitation to trap Peter. Or, in essence, he's going to put the cloak on, if you guys remember the What If episode where Peter's wearing the cloak, and he becomes Spider-Man Supreme, if you will. I just made that name up. The point is, it's kind of a callback or reference. If it actually happens, the Cloak of Levitation will trap Peter. So for that very brief moment, Peter will don the Cloak of Levitation, and it is going to bring him back to Strange to where they can uh, work out their problems. Because you know, like I said, it's two official Avengers. They're not really gonna be fighting. Maybe they are. Maybe Peter throws a punch. Maybe Doctor Strange hits him with something that stings a little bit. But in the bigger picture, they're both good guys. And it's more, like I said, a fight like Captain America Civil War, where you know nobody, there's no stakes here. You know uh, they're not, one of them isn't going to off the other one. Obviously, that would be silly. So you kind of already know before it happens that they're going to make up. But it's going to be interesting to see how they get into this fight or chase scene and what the consequences of it are. So all we ever hear is talks about Tommy McGuire and Andrew Garfield and Tom Holland all teaming up against the Sinister Six and those fights. Well, here's another fight. And we've already talked about it in the past. People knew about it, but... It's going to be interesting to see what this cube actually does, why Peter wanted to steal the cube, and if we're correct in saying Doctor Strange's spell is what really is the catalyst to start all the timelines coming together. I have some information on that I can't really share at the moment, but down the road... Uh, We've got some stuff to talk about. So there you go, guys. That is the current leak that is circulating the internet about this fight scene between Doctor Strange and Peter Parker, Tom Holland, Spider-Man. It makes sense to me. It kind of coincides with what we've seen in the trailer. Maybe we'll get some new insight with the official trailer when it actually comes out, hopefully around uh, the beginning of November. I wouldn't be, uh, my feelings wouldn't be hurt if it came out October. Just saying. You guys let me know what you think. I hope you have a great day. And I'll see you soon.